Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. We are back with more reaction bullshit on my bullshit channel. Last time I did a Kingdom Hearts thing, I said I didn't want to like, I really don't care about reactions and stuff like that, and I still don't. But at this point, it's kind of inevitable. Can't speak. At this point, it's kind of inevitable um, when it comes to Kingdom Hearts three because it has finally re reached a point where. It is now, it is like, Kingdom Hearts has finally reached a point where it is now part of the mainstream. I know, like, during Dream Drop Distance and stuff like that, like, it was getting there, and of course, people always joke and make memes about it, but half of the people who did that never actually played a goddamn Kingdom Hearts game. But now that 3 is coming out, and it's really, really close, before they fucking delay it, or whatever the hell may happen, um, it's really inevitable to, uh, to, like, just ignore this shit. It's gonna be everywhere. So, recently, the big hit, the Big Hero Six trailer for Kingdom Hearts came out. I have not seen it yet. This is my first time seeing it. And I want to say the well before we get into this, you're free to fucking disagree with me all you want. I really don't care. Every the half of the fan base of Kingdom Hearts are just like nostalgia blinded or whatever. But the way I feel about Kingdom Hearts right now in terms of how people are reacting to it and stuff like that, at least from what I've seen, is either you're reporting on Kingdom Hearts because it's your job and you're doing it poorly, I, AK IGN, you know what I mean? Um, did I say AK? Wow. I meant AKA. AKA IGN. <laughs> or you're one of the millions of Kingdom Hearts YouTubers who I will not name because I... Listen, I don't intentionally mean I don't intentionally mean to throw shade, but I'm gonna throw it anyways. Um, the way I feel when it comes to those group of people, I feel like since they're so diehard fans for it, they have like their criticisms are like they barely have any, right? So as someone who has been with Kingdom Hearts since like 2004 and grow up with Kingdom Hearts. And someone who really, really, honestly to God, thinks the story is bullshit, but I still play it because I have no fucking respect for myself. I wanna, I wanna talk about this. So without further ado, let's fucking begin. God damn it! <sighs> please, 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 don't be shit. Let me, let me move that out the way. Is that gonna disappear? Come on, disappear. I want I want the thing to disappear. So we have Hero and Baymax. So <laughs> healthcare. Alright. Yeah, personal healthcare companion. So apparently the big Hero 6 world is gonna be like a direct sequel. Oh my god, it's my boy Wasabi. This looks great. Oh, Sora gets a little, like, little pair of goggles and stuff like that. Oh, it's Randall. Those are the nobodies that are like Marluxia. Or Marluxia, whatever the hell you want to pronounce it. Oh, they fixed his model! Hell yeah! Thank you! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, they fixed his fucking model. Okay, that looks cool. That's a boss, though. That has to be a boss. He had so much health. I'm gonna assume that the, uh gummy ships oh that gummy ship look good the bomb one okay it doesn't look shit gummy ship may actually be fun this time around okay there's ventanitas luxord is back ansem still looks kind of shit aqua has a new outfit now wait 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 wait, wait hold up is there more no okay so let's go back real quick I'm doing this on the PS4, so I'm not really that I'm not really that good at this. Um, I could have done it on my PC, but I didn't feel like hooking all the wires up. All right, I want to get the. Uh... All right, Sora, Luxord, uh, fucking, she looks good. Her character model looks good, Larxine. Uh, they're looking at the pictures with Roxas and stuff. You know, I guess they're finally. I guess they're gonna tell Hainer, Pence, and Olette that there's another version of their world. Well, I think they already know that, but they're probably gonna go deep into it with Roxas and stuff. 
Ansem, uh, Zigbar. Zigbar looks better. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Wait, let's go back for a moment. Well, before we go back, let me just say, I, I don't know if this is a flashback. This may be a flashback right here with Ventanitas. This may be a flashback, and it seems like it's in the Land of Departure, uh, like where the Keyblade Masters are at and stuff like that. Let's just go back real quick. Who the fuck was that? Let me just... Slowly. Alright. I don't know who the hell that is. It seems like they're... I'm sorry, like, I'm not really good at this. <laughs> Especially since I'm doing it on PS4, it's bad. Um, oh, you know what? I can just slow it down. I can just slow it down. We can just do that. You can just head to settings. Head to speed. Just put that shit, like, half speed. It's gonna sound ugly, too. It's gonna sound gross. Okay, well, that's not really half speed. It's still going pretty fast. What the fuck? Alright. Well, it seems like, to me, that... That the, um... That the person... In there is also at the, uh... Let me see if I can just inch my way through. Can I do that? Is that a possibility? Oh, what's this? I didn't see this. Fucking, uh, Sora and Mickey in them. Like, right here. It's blurry, but... Uh, fucking... It looks like... To me, it looks like they're in, um... The Keyblade Graveyard. From what I can tell. There's Aqua. Huh. This is really, uh... Yeah, it's not really slowed down that much. All right. Either they're in, they're in like the front gates to uh, Beast's castle, or they're in the world that never was. They're in some fucking dark place. I don't know who the fuck this is, but huh? It can't be. It can't be fucking. It can't be any of the Z. Well, do any of the Xehanorts have like their hair coming to the front of their face? And it can't be Aqua because they're hiding it intentionally. So. I don't know. This is actually... Hmm. A closer guess would probably be... Probably... Maybe not. Maybe... <laughs> it might be Xion? If it's not Xion, then it's fucking Aqua in like a... In a robe or whatever. But it's a, but it's probably not Aqua because she now has like a new outfit too, right? Oh yeah, okay. So this looks like they're in the land of uh, the Keyblade Graveyard. Yeah, see, Aqua has, like, a new outfit. She has the Star Seeker now, or at least... No, that's not Star Seeker. What is that? That's a that's a new Keyblade entirely. Hmm, okay. Well, that's interesting. That's really interesting. Let's just play through this again. Um, shit, I really... You got Tomogo. She's awesome. Seems like the main villain of, uh... Of can of a uh, hero blah, blah, big big shit big hero six I can't speak today what the hell is wrong with me it seems like the main villain of the big hero six world is probably uh the dude with like the mask and the million of like little things that hero created or whatever like the doctor he might be turned into a heartless who knows uh okay so Sora's keyblade for big hero six seems to be heavily focused on. On like the little nanobots or whatever the hell they were in Big Hero 6. Because there's a lot of particles for that. Alright. Man, I'm still not liking the, the fuck. I, I thought it would grow on me, the goddamn song. For the opening. But uh. Oh wait, we always. N I just realized. Luxord's been back since E3. Duh. I completely forgot about him. I forgot he's in the um, Pirates world because for some reason he has a hard on for Jack Sparrow. Larxene is fucking awesome. Well, that's her in the Frozen world because for some reason you saw Kristoff in the background, right? I don't know who the fuck that is. I, I'm I'm really guessing Shion. Let me just see. Ah, shit. Well, whatever. Whatever. That's Kingdom Hearts 3 Big Hero 6 trailer. Holy shit. This game looks really great. It's just, I just wish that Riku wasn't so much like fucking Noctis. He looks just like, oh my fucking god, Hero looks so good. The big Hero 6 characters all look really good.
I wonder what Randall's gonna do, right? Maybe he's gonna be like kind of like Oogie Boogie and like Kid Hearts 2 and just like work machines and try to fuck you over that way. I'm so happy they fixed his model. I'm so happy they fixed his model. They did, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> they, they did it, man. Huh. Sora's clothes changed. I just realized that. Are dry forms back? They can't be back. His clothes are like changing and shit and like lighting up and stuff. Huh. We all know Keyblade transformations like you can now do them on the fly and stuff. Like you don't have to go into a menu. That was a big thing that they showed at uh, Gamescom, I believe. Man. Yeah, see like his Keyblade is heavily focused on the little nanomachines. You can see them like doing a little particle effects and shit like that. Baymax is in your team. Okay. Seems like this is going to be kind of a big world. I think they, I think it's pretty much confirmed that they got rid of like the, like the different screens. Like how you would go to a different place in the world and it would like load in and load out and stuff like that. I think they completely got rid of that. What's interesting to me is that if they did get rid of that, right now this seems to be in the Big Hero 6 world. Well, it has to be because Baymax is there. Duh. Um, there's a nighttime here, but if they got rid of all the loading screens, they may be just a day-night cycle. Probably, maybe. I don't know how they're going to deal with that. Right? Or like maybe a cutscene triggered something. Or maybe there are some areas that do have a loading screen. Or maybe you have to fast travel to different areas and stuff like that. Larxene looks so fucking good. I love you. I love you, Larxene. Like, you're my favorite because you're just a fucking sadist. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna I'm gonna bet 100%. I'm gonna bet this is Shion. It has to be Shion. I, like, there's no one else I can possibly think of. Like, let, let me just go down the fucking line of whatever. What's really weird to me is that if, like, there are some people who get the gray hair like Xehanort, but there are others like Zigbar and Larxene who just get the eyes and, like, nothing really happens to them. They just kind of look the same. Uh, I don't think Marluxia, I don't think he's a Xehanort either, because I think the last time we saw him, he didn't have the, the yellow, like, golden eyes. Not up. It, well, if memory serves me correctly. I just really want to get a good like shot. There we go. Yeah, she uh, her design, her new design seems to be. I I'm not sure if it's just like the. Uh, it's kind of weird to me, cause like you can see her legs like, like it's like phasing to a different color, so that's weird. But then she also has red gloves, like she's kind of wearing a different version of the Vin uh, Ventanitas outfit. So I really don't know, but. Did, uh, was that the Keyblade Aqua always had? Like, in the E3 trailer? Did she always have that Keyblade? Huh. Okay. That's kind of... What kind of Keyblade is that? It's not Star Seeker because it's 100% different. It's like Star Seeker and Kingdom Key had a baby and then made it look like a fucking... Like a jousting thing because it has the little, like, ring thing at the bottom near the hilt. Like, the same thing as a jousting, like, Lance kind of has. So, it's weird to me. I don't know what the fuck that is. So, huh. Man, I'm just... Fuck you, Mickey. It's your fault. You talk way too long. <laughs> you talk way too long, dude. Also, there's a, apparently this new thing going out there now called... Called Nording or whatever. Like, someone said... If someone told me one time that Aqua got Norded. What the fuck is that? Like, I understand it's supposed to be, uh, it's supposed to be people who got turned into Zane or, or whatever, so it's, you got Norded. But it's like, whoever came up with the fucking term Norded, like, I'm sorry, man, just go, just go, man or girl or whoever you are, just go stand in a fucking corner for like two seconds, dude. But, um, yeah, that's the Big Hero 6 trailer. Not really that much to go off of. Like, not even the things they say are really that deep to look into. Unlike, uh, unlike the other stuff with, um, with, like, uh, when they first revealed Riku and stuff like that. 
where Riku's like saying some weird cryptid shit, but you know, it's Kingdom Hearts, they always say cryptid shit. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. There's really nothing else for me to look at here. No matter how many times I can fucking... That fucking... That... What the hell is up with the close captioning? It's not changing. There we go. Now it's speeding through. That's weird. Alright. There's really nothing else to really look at. No matter how many times I go through it, there's nothing else for me to really, like, look at or nitpick as. Oh, wait, hold up. Let's go back. Is that, like, a Final Fantasy reference or something in the background? Right there? What is that? <laughs> something Rex? What is that? You see that back there? This? Look at that fucking sword. It's all shiny and shit. Play Plus? It says Square Enix, so this might be, like, a Final Fantasy reference or something like that. Vermin Rex. Or ver, not vermin, verum rex. I don't know what the fuck that is. Huh. That's pretty cool. That looks nice. I don't know what the hell that is. Huh. I'm really like just going back and forth, like just looking at this, trying to nitpick what I can see. But there's really nothing. There's nothing here. There's just. This is just for style, but I mean, TGS is around the corner. TGS is like, what, the 23rd to the 25th or something like that? So, when that happens, they're definitely going to show more, more Kingdom Hearts shit. I love you, Lark scene. I really do. I really do. I don't know who the fuck you are. I really don't. It has to be she There's no one else that it could possibly be. Alright, well... You seen it here? You you heard me stumble around. Let's believe that that fucking date is true and that we will get it. <laughs> Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. TGS is gonna come around. And they're gonna be like, "Did we say January? We meant March." I'm sorry, right? Please be excited. Please be excited for more. All right. Um. But yeah, that's Kingdom Hearts 3. I thought they would show something else like that. There's the E3 trailer, but we've seen that already and stuff like that at like Xbox's thing and PlayStation's thing. Yeah, Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, I mean, there was really nothing bad in this trailer to really look at, you know, besides for the story. The story. The story's pretty fucking bad. I'm sorry for those who love the story. The story's bad. <laughs> I love Kingdom Hearts. I stick with it all these years. I follow the story, but I I know the story's bad, but I still love it too. So we we can we can both go through this together, you and I. But anyways, that's it for this shitty reaction. If you watch the whole thing, thank you. If you didn't and you skipped to the end, well, I don't care. <laughs> I can't I can't force you to do anything. But um, yeah, that was Kingdom Hearts trailer. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and all that jazz. In the comment section below, most importantly, tell me what you think about the game so far. I really want to get into some conversation and stuff like that. If you don't want to leave a comment, you can just DM me on Twitter. My Twitter's in the description below. You can just send me a fucking DM. I'll fucking talk to you. I'm lonely. I got nothing to do in my life. Nobody loves me. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways, as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Chef, chef, too.